Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice systems of equation? Okay, let's leave this as equation one, and here as equation two. And from here, let's subtract equation two from equation one. That is, we have equation one minus equation two. From the left hand side, we have x times y plus x then minus. We put this in bracket as x times y plus y then equals to 21 minus 24 then minus here open this bracket this becomes x times y plus x then minus xy minus y equals to minus 3 from here and here xy minus xy this cancel each other then we are left with x minus y which is equals to minus 3 from here then from what we have here we make x the subject and take minus y to this side and we have x equals to y minus 3 so let's label this as equation 3 and from what we have in equation 2, which is x times y plus y equals to 24 from equation 2 here, then we substitute the value of x here now, and this gives us y minus 3, then times y plus y here equals to 24. Then y open this bracket, so this gives us y square minus 3y plus y equals to 24. And this same thing as y square minus 2y equals to 24. Then from here, let's add one to both sides. Add one on this side and also add one on this side then what we have here will become y square minus 2y plus 1 equals to 24 plus 1 as 25 then from here what we have follows from what we have a square minus 2ab plus b square which can be written as a minus b all squared and here we have a here to be y and b here to be one so here we can write this as y minus one squared equals to 25 then from here we take the square roots on both sides here and this square root on this side and also square root here and what we have here square cancel square root we have y minus 1 equals to plus or minus 5 from here now this here we have either y minus 1 equals to 5 or we have y minus 1 equals to minus 5 then we can solve for y by taking minus y here so we have y equals to 5 plus 1 now then y equals to 6 from here then also here taking minus 1 here we have become plus so we have y equals to minus 5 plus 1 and here y equals to minus 4 then also we can get the corresponding value of x from the relation in equation 3 that is x equals to y minus 3 then if this is y1 and this is y2 then x1 here will become y which is y1 6 minus 3 and x1 here will be equals to 3 so on this side we have x1 comma y1 can now be written as 3 comma 6 then on this side as well 
we use the same relation to get the value of x2 so we have x2 now equals to y2 which is minus 4 then minus 3 then we have x2 here equals to minus 7 then we have x2 comma y2 now equals to minus 7 comma minus 4 then we can run a check to confirm if this set of solutions satisfy the given problem from equation 1 which is x times y plus x equals to 21 let's substitute the first set of solution here then we have 3 times 6 then plus 3 is this equals to 21 from here that is 3 times 6 here we have 18 plus 3 is this equals to 21 and here 18 plus 3 of course is 21 which is equals to 21 so here this satisfies the first equation now also let's substitute that in the second equation which is x times y equals to 24 and that becomes 3 times 6 then plus y plus 6 is equals to 24 then this is 18 plus 6 is equals to 24 and this is 24 equals to 24 and here it also satisfies the second equation now let's check for the second set of solution as well from here in equation one we have x times y that's minus seven times minus four then plus x that's plus minus seven is equals to 21 from here then minus times minus here that's plus so seven times four that's 28 then plus times minus minus seven is equals to 21 then 28 minus 7 that's 21 which is equals to 21 so this satisfies the first equation and also substitute that in the second equation here so we have x times y plus y that's minus 7 times minus 4 plus minus 4 is equals to 24 then minus 7 times minus 4 that's 28 then here we have minus 4 is equals to 24 of course 28 minus 4 that's 24 it is equals to 24 and hence this also satisfies the second equation and thank you for watching don't forget the steps subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell on share this video give it a thumbs up see you next class and bye for now